So, Aussie Open, the acclaimed, the Young Bucks, all tag teams, all real tag teams that we have unfinished business with. But first, but first we got next week, we got Hartford, Connecticut, July 29th, we have MJF and Adam Cole. And I, under, I get it, I get it. I understand, you guys kind of like them right now, right? But, but do you trust MJF? Adam, listen to me. Do you trust Max? Because I don't, from first-hand experience. Anybody remember the pinnacle? I saw firsthand, day in and day out, the type of person that Max really is. And as a wise man once said, the greatest trick the devil ever pulled was making you think he doesn't exist. And he's doing it again. But I'm telling you right here, right now, Adam, when this, when this man shows you, when this man tells you exactly what he is, listen to him. Do not trust him. Next week, you are not gonna beat FTR, baby. Yikes. Yikes. Uh, so, Tony, when I was about 14, maybe 15 years old, my dad made me go out to Columbus County Cash and Carry. He said, you gotta get a job, son, okay? And, uh, and yeah, I booed too when he told me that. Uh, and uh, every single day after school, these same group of kids came in. And they, they were a little overprivileged, and their parents gave them money every day, and, and, and they came in and they made fun of me because I had to get a job. And I promised myself that day, I promised myself if I ever seen those kids, if I got the opportunity, I'd take my right hand, come across their face from behind, and crack them in the nose. I never got that opportunity. I never got that opportunity. But that scenario reminds me of exactly what we're going through right now. Tony, I don't know what it seems like to you, but to me it feels like MJF and Adam Cole Bebe. Uh, there we go. Uh, it feels like to me that they, uh, they take this tag team championship as a joke, and it feels like to me they take this tag team championship match as a joke. And, uh, and for, for, for me, I mean, it's the comedy skits. It's the, it's, uh, yeah, I know, we like them, yes. Hey, I like the double clothesline too. But for me, it's the comedy skits. It's, 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 it's all the, it's, it's the dance break, Tony. They took a dance break in the middle of the biggest match of their tag team career. And for me, and for me, for 10 years, 10 long years, I have done everything I could. I have torn my ACLs, I've torn my meniscus, my labrum, my bicep, my labrum. I've torn it all just for the opportunity to make FTR the greatest tag team in professional wrestling. So next week, next week in Hartford, Connecticut, <laughs> in Hartford, Connecticut, there won't be any dance break. There won't be any comedy. Because I'm going to take out on you exactly what I should have done to those kids when I was 15 years old. We're going to give Max and we're going to give Adam something the real world never threatened him with. And that's an ass kicking. Top guys, out.